Exclusive sit down with a coach. Here's Cutter's Corner. All right, with the West Coast trip, the Bucks pushed their Monday back a little bit, so I just spoke with head coach Dirk Cutter a couple of minutes ago, and obviously the big topic coming back uh, from that ugly loss in Arizona, the status of quarterback Jameis Winston. He is indeed injured, and uh, the Bucks have a plan moving forward. So here is our exclusive chat with the coach, Dirk Cutter. Coach, how's Jameis feeling today? And, and uh, yesterday he, he was you know, almost defiant. Listen, I'm going to play next week, but, but how is he doing today? And, and, and what have you guys had a chance to talk about? Yeah, well, Jameis is sore today. And, uh, you know, he's sore after most games. Uh, Jameis is also extremely tough and has a very, very high pain threshold. So, you know, I don't ever doubt when Jameis says he can play. Yeah, we did get an MRI today, and he has a sprained AC joint. And he's day to day right now, and it'll be. Uh, we'll just have to see how the week goes uh, to see how much he can tolerate. It's, it's more an, an issue of uh, can he tolerate the pain. Now, once a quarterback, always a quarterback. So I'll ask the quarterback in the room here. When there's any type of pain or discomfort, it's not a, a, a long-term risk thing that I guess that weighs on his mind, but it's accuracy, it's, it's power. What concerns you and Jameis collectively when you say, okay, let's monitor the week and see how it goes? Well, the only thing is really Jameis's health long term. I mean, that's that's the most important thing. And, uh, you know, the doctors, they'll decide if there's any long term issues. Mm -hmm. uh, the tests revealed right now no structural damage. And uh, but as far as the uh, uh, Jameis actually playing, it would be the power issue. You know, that was the thing yesterday when when he had to come out as he felt like he just couldn't drive the ball down the field. He made one throw in the in the later position. It went across his body, and, and I don't remember how far it went, but it looked okay. Do you think that was probably a point where he said, ah, that wasn't very comfortable? Well, it was somewhere in there. It was somewhere in there because Jameis did go back in and play a few plays after, after the injury, and at, at some point, you know, maybe four or five plays after that, you know, he just came up and said, I don't feel like I can drive the ball. And at that point, we went to Ryan. We spoke to Brent Grimes and Gerald McCoy after the game yesterday, and, and uh, to a man, they said it was embarrassing how the, how the thing started out for them. What did you see on the film? And, and when you're talking about tackling, like you mentioned, and then scheme-wise, just what happened when you got a chance to really evaluate it? Well, it, embarrassing is the right word, and we just... Uh, we just didn't come out ready to play in the in the first half. That obviously starts with me. But you know we can't. We we knew Arizona's game plan. They didn't change anything. They just changed their running back. But uh, we didn't tackle well. We didn't fit the run well. We didn't handle play action very well. And then on the other side of the ball, that was going to be one of those games where we needed to keep pace. And we had too many breakdowns, individual breakdowns, drop ball on third down. Uh, you know, you just can't spot a team 31 and then say you're going to turn it on and make a furious comeback. All right, 38 to 33, the final, guys. Jameis Winston, you heard the coach day to day. It's a pain tolerance thing. Ryan Fitzpatrick played pretty well, uh, except for the two interceptions against the Cardinals. So both of these guys, I'm sure, going to see plenty of reps as the Bucks get ready now at two and three to hit the road again to take on the Buffalo Bills. Guys, let's send it back to you. All right, thank you, Dan. We know uh, Jameis needs to play well if the Bucks are going to do well. We need him back in the lineup for sure. He's the star. No 